What's up guys, Totally Dubbed here, and today I'm going to be making a guide for Darkie's Resurrection 10.1 um, RE um, version by um, Facetto. Um, so, <laughs> so first of all what you want to do is uh, disable Voodoo. And so you can disable Voodoo like this. Very simple. Go back and reboot system now. So um, I'll get back to you after that's done. So once you've disabled the lag fix, and that's optional obviously if you haven't disabled, uh, if you've never enabled the lag fix you don't have to disable it, um, obviously. Uh, then you want to put it into um, download mode. So we go into download. And we go on the computer. Now on the, com uh, on the computer I'm going to show you, um, basically you'll get a .zip file and you basically want to extract that and once you extract it it will look like this you've got Odin 1.3, 1.7.tar and .pit file so if I open Odin 1.7 up uh, the phone isn't connected yet open PIT make sure you're putting in the right PIT um, just a funny story I uh, just now accidentally flashed over Facetta Diodex uh, JVH um, that's a pre well, yeah. <laughs> I didn't flash over 10.1, in other words. Um, so that was pretty funny. So make sure you put the right PIT file because Odin does remember where, um, you know, where's the last thing that you entered. So remember, Dark Resurrection 10.1. There you go. Now in Odin 1.7, repartition will be automatically ticked, and you want that to be ticked. Whereas in 1.3, if I open PIT it does not automatically tick it, so you want to tick it, so remember that that uh, you have to tick repartition in, well, or have to make make sure that it's ticked so I'm going to do it in 1.7, so there you go uh, now I'm just going to connect the phone up and there you go, it's their COM13 for me and it's connected. So make sure that's in there. Darky Resurrection 10.1, Darky Resurrection 10.1 or two files were flashing. Repartition is ticked and press start. So just remember, disable your lang fixes, make sure repartition is ticked, and uh, well back up your data if you need to, that is, and um, and flash it over. So I'll get back to you in around I think around three minutes um, and uh, I'll resume the video. Right, so uh, after it being disconnected a couple of times from the PC and reconnecting, comes up with a yellow sort of screen. And there you go, there's the uh, boot animation, Darkies ROM Gingerbread V10. It's um, uh, identical to the Extreme Edition one that uh, was there. And there we go, after just a um, couple of minutes, um, we're on a Facetto's JVH. So I'm going to show you on the settings menu, as you can see the green overscroll, about phone, basement JVO, dark core 2.5, so a new dark core, and darky rom jvh v 10one is what you should be reading. So hopefully guys, you, um, you enjoyed this guide, remember don't be an idiot like I was. Um, and choose the wrong PIT and .tar files from a previous install, choose the right ones. Um, another thing is the, um, the white settings over here are due to the market. Once you sign in with the market you get green notifications, as in the green um, Wi-Fi for example. Um, so yeah, there you go, you can connect and everything. And um, another thing is uh, swipe, I don't think is installed on here, uh, local and text, there you go, it's a gingerbread keyboard, so swipe isn't installed, if you want to install swipe, literally put in swipe in Google on your desktop PC, and uh, you will find um, how to register for the beta, and once you do that they'll send an email to your phone, you go through there and open the APK file, very simple stuff. And um, apart from that, I think that's pretty much it. I don't think there's anything else I should uh, demonstrate. But there you go. Hope you enjoyed that video, guys. And that's totally dubbed out. Bye-bye.